Alright then everyone, hello and welcome back to another episode of the Final Fantasy VI Blindfolded LLG. I swear this is louder than it should be for this volume. I'll turn it down a bit. So I'll go up to the top here. Say hello to this guy, but not really because I don't care what his day is like. Not important to me. Seriously, shut up with your small talk. Stupid guy in a pink shirt. One, two, three. Alright, that should line me up with the door, and then I'll need to remember one more three for this segment. Oh yeah, right. One, two, three. I was almost expecting the music to get louder there for a moment, but uh forgot that it doesn't start out quiet in the other room like it's supposed to. Let's just go to the right, left and up for a while, so that I reach the balcony. Dirt Dragon's really not that hard, even if I mess him up once or twice, he's gonna go down really quickly, to be honest. Hopefully I'll just, uh, get lucky and never even have to put any effort into this. Well, that would be boring, to be honest, but <laughs> it's almost likely to happen, really. As long as I don't mess up. One step left into this room. Should be far enough. Left, up, right. Goodbye. Whoopsie, I probably shouldn't hit that. Now I'm gonna get stuck fighting a dragon. Totally unexpected. Okay, shadows on cursor one, and the other two are on cursor two. So this is probably Gilgo. -Go. I was wrong. It's Celeste. Oh shoot. That wasn't what I meant to do. One, two, three. Poison him. Now this is Go Go. So you go and throw your shadow thing. This is Shadow, so you set up Golem for the party. I didn't do that in time, but it didn't make a difference either. I probably could have, uh... Alright, this is... This should be Celeste, so I'll just have her defend. Or maybe I was wrong. This is Shadow, so he doesn't need to do anything. Why do I keep hearing attacking noises on the left side of the screen? What the? Okay, seriously, what is Gogo -Go doing? Has he gone insane? Because... There's no way he can be inflicted with any statuses or anything in this fight. Did I accidentally set him onto a rage by accident? Rage that I don't want at that rate? Well, I could always try attacking Gogo. -Go. It's a bit of a waste of his image status, but... Oh yeah, right. I forgot. I changed around the uh, rage and throw commands just before. Ah, that was dumb. I should have just left him, because apparently I felt found it more intuitive that way. So now I gotta figure out a way to kill Gogo. -Go. Um Or I could possibly just sit here until poison kills him. Combination of poison and Gogo's -Go's amazing fire spells. I bet those are doing like a whole 100 damage to him. Uh, let's see what I can do. You should still be on poison, so poison go go. That should at least be able to cut through. Because otherwise, this will take a lot longer. Oh, that wasn't poison. 
And that wasn't poison either, so... Who wants to bet the dragon's almost never going to kill Gogo? -Go. He'll probably die poison first. Uh, three down to poison. I think I'll be on shadow like this, so down to Gogo. -Go. Oh yeah, Shadow doesn't have any magic, does he? I'm not hearing Go Go, maybe he died. Wait a couple seconds. Uh, shoot. Gogo -Go probably died again, so let's just revive him. Potion wouldn't be very useful here. Gogo -Go sh should beat Celeste to the punch here. Alright, so up to throw. Shadow. Edge. There we go. Now that's what's supposed to happen. You two just sit there and defend. I want Gogo's turn to come back up again so I can set him to what I want to be. One, two, three, four, five, six. At this rate, I've been so slow that I'm probably only going to need two <laughs> step mines. But I guess that's why I poisoned him in the first place to account to make it so that I'm getting damage off during when I inevitably mess up. So, otherwise, it's totally useless. Yeah, I was right. <laughs> only two step mines because I was being that lame. Whatever, all's good. Pretty easy fight considering 90% of his attacks don't hurt me and the rest of his attacks don't hurt me very well. <laughs> Alright, so I'll just uh, do the menu trick here and then walk straight out because it's very kind about putting me straight in front of the entrance. How much more generous could you possibly be? And I've been on the save command this entire segment just for simplicity. Seven minutes. Well, at least that pads out the length of recording a little. It's still a little short, but it's a boss and it's its own thing, so I don't, I can't really justify putting it with anything else. See you next time.